Today, we embark on an exhilarating journey through the world of the Hoka Mach 6, uh, a shoe that promises not just to accompany your strides, but to elevate your entire running experience. Having clocked over 80 miles in these remarkable kicks, I'm eager to share my insights. So let's lace up and plunge into the details. First, let's rewind and explore the fascinating evolution of the Mach series. Hoka's saga has been anything but straightforward. From the highly lauded Mach 4, which garnered rave reviews, to the somewhat perplexing Mach Supersonic, the path has been a roller coaster. Now we arrive at the Mach 6, a model that's turning heads and raising eyebrows alike with its innovative supercritical foam midsole and enhanced materials. But does this latest iteration truly soar to new heights? Let's uncover the truth. With over 80 miles logged in the Mach 6, I can confidently say it's a shoe that has charmed me. The bounce afforded by that supercritical foam, pure magic. It seamlessly fills the void left by my beloved Rebel V2, soothing that aching spot in my rotation, minus the anxiety of an upper catastrophe mid-run. Stability, impeccable. The gentle rocker design facilitates smooth transitions from heel to toe, making every stride feel fluid. And let's not overlook the durable door abrasion rubber outsole. It's crafted to endure the rigors of countless miles. As I often exclaim, I feel the need, the need for speed. And the Mach 6 delivers not just comfort, but a buoyant ride as you glide over asphalt. Aesthetics too play a crucial role, right? The Mach 6 doesn't skimp here. My all white version boasts a sleek silhouette and at a feather light 6.8 aughts for my size, it strikes the perfect balance between performance and understated elegance. It stands as a reliable daily trainer, never clamoring for attention, but always ready to deliver. Now let's pivot to performance. While the Mach 6 handles casual runs with aplomb, it's not tailored for the high octane speed sessions. Picture it as the Rocky Balboa of running shoes. Not necessarily a speed demon, but a paragon of stability and endurance. Nonetheless, it excels in daily runs, keeping your legs fresh and poised for whatever challenges lie ahead. Of course, no shoe is without its caveats. While I adore the Mach 6, a couple of concerns linger. The midsole, while delightful, might be susceptible to compression over time. However, I've yet to encounter any issues. And for those accustomed to the propulsion of a carbon plate, you may find the Mach 6 a touch subdued in that department. It's an exceptional daily trainer, but perhaps not my first choice for tempo runs or race day sprints. Uh, Hoka Mach 6 pros and cons. Pros, durability. The durable door abrasion rubber outsole is built to last. Lightweight at 6.8 aughts, it's a featherweight option. Versatile, suitable for daily runs and recovery jogs. Cons, midsole compression. The midsole may compress over time. Lack of carbon plate. For those seeking propulsion, carbon plate might be missed. So what's the verdict on the Hoka Mach 6? It's a daily trainer that strikes all the right chords. Comfortable, bouncy, and priced reasonably at $140. Whether you're embarking on a long adventure or a quick recovery jog, this shoe delivers a smooth, stable ride that's tough to rival. If you're in the market for a trustworthy addition to your running repertoire, the Mach 6 may just be your perfect match. Thank you for joining me on this exploration of the Hoka Mach 6. If you found this review insightful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell for more gear evaluations. And as always, happy running.